Three, two, one. Hey, welcome back to another episode of This Guy's Thoughts. Uh, like I always, appreciate swinging by and watching another beer review. Uh, tonight's episode, we're going to take a look at one out of uh, BrewDog. Uh, this here is their uh, Elvis Juice. It is a uh, it says a grapefruit infused IPA with natural citrus flavors. This is coming in at uh, six and a half percent alcohol by volume. Uh, not sure what the uh, the IBU is. I will have it listed in the uh, description if I can find one. But we, I do know six and a half percent alcohol by volume. This is one I've had a few times over the years. Uh, I did review it here on the channel a couple years back. Um, I figured uh, I'd go ahead and knock out another review. Um, see if uh, my taste buds has changed much uh, over the uh, last couple years towards this one here. Uh, it's probably been a year or better since I've actually had this in general. Um, I do remember it uh, being uh, very good, a lot of grapefruit, uh, but uh, we'll see. Uh, we'll see what it offers this time around. So as far as the artwork on this, uh, probably going to give it uh, about a 3.75 out of five on the chart. Um, it's decent enough. They list the ABV. Uh, the name itself is cool, Elvis Juice. Uh, I'm sure there's a backstory behind uh, the title. It's uh, the name of this beer. I just uh, don't know what it is myself. Uh, it says, actually, it says right here, Elvis Juice, the absolute king in a world of wannabes. So, yeah, I guess that makes sense there. So a lot of grapefruit already. Uh, just a zesty grapefruitness. I can already smell it in the, in the, uh, the aroma here floating around. Yeah, just a massive amount of grapefruit in this one. Um, and the really ripe grapefruit. Yeah, just a ripe, ripe, uh, ruby red uh, grapefruit. Uh, about a finger and a half ahead up on top of this. Just a nice uh, copperish, dark orange color. You got some floaties floating around in there. Uh, not sure how fresh this is. Uh, I've had it a little bit. Um, we're probably looking at, uh, yeah, this is a few months old easily. Um, but it should still, uh, be worth the drink. Man, just a ton, a ton of just ripe grapefruit here. That's all I, that's all I pick up on this. Nothing else in the aroma, just a lot of grapefruit. So, uh, let's see what the taste offers. Yeah. So... First off, uh, mouthfeel, body, medium body, uh, refreshing, uh, crisp finish. Maybe a bit of a dry, crisp uh, finish to this. Very refreshing, um, very flavorful. There's a lot of grapefruit in this. Um, mildly bitter. A little bit of a piney aftertaste or a, just a very mild piney aftertaste to this lingers around a little bit six and a half percent alcohol I actually do pick up just a hint of the alcohol just a little bit of a warmingness there of the alcohol But yeah, I think uh, I really enjoy this one. I think last time I gave it a 4 out of 5. Um, uh, I think this time I'm good with giving this a good a 4.25 out of 5. Uh, this is a BrewDog Elvis Juice. Um, it's probably one of the better brews that I've actually had uh, from BrewDog. And I've probably only had a half a dozen things from uh, offerings from BrewDog. But this is definitely uh, towards the top if I'm just uh, going by uh, memory off the top of my head. This is uh, more towards the uh, the better offerings that I've had from them. So I'm good with a 4.25 out of 5 all day long on this. If you're one that likes a lot of grapefruit, um, th this is the one for you right here. This is... Um, just a, a, a ripe, fresh grapefruitness to this. So, 
Anyhow, like, subscribe, comment, uh, check me out on social media. That's my thoughts.